the Lawyers Committee for Human Rights, Klinowal Public Union and Women's Crisis Center held a round table on the monitoring and protection of women's rights in trials, problems and perspectives. The chairman of the Lawyers Committee for Human Rights, Akif Alizade, said that the committee has been monitoring the defense of women's rights in trials since October 2010. According to him, they have monitored 153 court hearings involving women in Baku and other regions and have found that the general nature of the court hearings on violation of marriage, property and alimony lawsuits is troubling. There are now problems for women who are appealing to court. We need to strengthen the role of the judicial system in the areas of protection of families, provisions of women with the legal aid through the state budget and child welfare payments, added Alizada. The lawyers also said that the most of the divorces are filed based on domestic violence claims and that 87% of divorce lawsuits are initiated by women. Based on the surveys conducted through the project, Alizade said that courts do not help to keep families together. As a result of the monitoring, the organization discussed their proposed amendments and additions to the Court of Family Law, the Civil Procedure Court, the Criminal Court, and the Law on the Enforcement of Court Decisions. These include the creation of a specific family court and judge, writing the marriage age to 18 for women and 19 for men, creating a state alumni fund, severe punishments against parents who refuse to pay child support, and severe punishments for underage marriages. Human rights defender Rada Javadova said that family rehabilitation centers should assume an important role in preventing the collapse of young families. In addition, a balance of gender rights needs to be upheld. She believed that punishment mechanisms should not be increased, but concrete fines should be implemented. The head of Klenwell Public Union, Mehri Banzin Alava, believed that the improvement of family restoration centers is a necessary component of this movement. The project was implemented with support from Open Society Institute in Budapest.